All right, y'all, let's do this again. Hey, hey, and welcome to this video. My name is Nina and in today's video, we are actually going to be doing a little let's play or should I say let's decorate? Because I asked you guys over on Instagram if you would be interested in seeing that. So I thought, why not decorate together? So just a quick update. This little area that we are standing in right now, yeah, that's the product of a video I filmed last night but I sounded just very weird and off and tired and um, yeah, that video is not going to make it onto my channel. So um, yeah, quick update. So we ex or I exchanged some of the white flowers in this area for some yellow ones because like I said before that I was planning on introducing some more color onto my island. So I tried to start with incorporating some yellows because I think they complement the blue and the purple tones very well. And then up here we just added a little seating area with this little balloon. Just some cute decor as a transition area. And this build that we just walked past, I haven't uploaded yet, so we won't <laughs> go into detail about that one. But we still have this cliff space up here. And I thought we could maybe do a picnic thing as you can see by the title yeah so let's get started i already picked out some items nope that's not my inventory i already picked out some items and i really hope that i won't have to go back to my house as much but yeah we will see about that so i'm already recording way too long let's just <laughs> jump right into it. I really hope that I can talk over this while I'm thinking because yeah that's very difficult for me actually. Let me plan out what I'm actually going to do. So let's maybe just start with the trees because I always start with the trees. So that might be the perfect spot for one. Maybe one here because I want this little thing to kind of be sectioned off from here because I want to lead the path. Oh yeah, well, you will see it anyways. The speed build is coming very soon. <laughs> um, yeah, but I wanted to continue this path back here and then create a little foresty walkway and kind of lead the path up onto this cliff. So I want the picnic space to kind of be sectioned off from there. So we might start somewhere here and then lead a path here and have a picnic space right there. So could throw a tree here and then maybe another one uh, I don't like maybe a very very tiny one here and then is there enough space oh there's actually no space at all just to make this feel very tucked in so I'm thinking what am I thinking I'm thinking a large nope that one maybe yeah and then a large young hardwood no that's a large young cedar see my commentary is already going downhill so yeah bear with me today i'm sorry <laughs> actually let me grab some more trees and then i will come back to you guys Alrighty, so i did grab a small young cedar and a medium young hardwood but i think i do like this one maybe we can put the hardwood here just to add another tree because I'm very obsessed with my trees, you know. Throw another c cedar here. No. Now the question is, do we want something like that? No. Or we could actually slap the cedar here. Or should we do that there and then have another tree in front of it? Hmm. See, that's why I tend to do speed builds because I'm very indecisive and I think this cannot be entertaining for anyone to watch. But, you know, you gotta give the people what they want. And I asked you and you wanted it. So, you're getting it. Is it? I, I want a bush, but I wanted a lighter bush. Oh. I think I don't have that many tea leaf bushes. And the thing is, I always start off by saving my bushes whenever I flatten my island. And then I'm like, meh. I don't really want to move them and I get lazy and then I kind of throw them away and I always regret it in the end because well I always need them so uh, what you gonna do okay so maybe we can kind of litter this riverbed in some flowers and lead them 
all the way up to here kind of around this tree so that it feels like it's really a river bed you know because they tend to be very overgrown and then we can have the picnic blanket nestled in the trees or somewhere here yeah i think that's a good idea so maybe start off by adding some flowers let me grab some more bushes and some more flowers and actually no let's start decorating because i will keep running back and forth and that's kind of kind of annoying so let's start with the picnic blanket so i'm thinking i want to layer one because i layered so many picnic blankets on my last island and i'm not going to stop on this one so yeah um, um, um do i want to layer that here or? yeah okay 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 i have an idea so Let's put this diagonal one over top of this corner and then we can have a round one somewhere here. Yeah, I think that would look cute. Yeah, I like that. I like that. And maybe we can even go one further. I actually, I don't love not using fringes on my blankets, but what you gonna do? What you gonna do? But now that's squared. Do we like that? Do we like the squared? No, no nope nah you already know this blanket i will throw it everywhere i love it so much it's such a good design like look at it okay so anywho let's start with some items because i have already been recording for 15 minutes and we have not put down a single item i did bring a table with cloth which i haven't customized so let's just pray to the gods that this has a nice <gasps> Y'all. Ooh, I like that. I like that. Not that place, though. But I like that custom design. Yeah, maybe we can put it right against that. But no. Oh, actually, no. But now you, can, you can't see the layering. Wait, maybe we need to extend the cliff here. And then nestle the table in here okay let me extend the cliff and then i will come back to you actually all righty so we extended the cliff might need to expand a little bit further but for now i think it works i want to kind of have it tucked behind that tree yeah i think i like that and then maybe we can have a little blanket, like another blanket peek through here to kind of balance it with the ones we have here. Which one should we use? Which one should we use, guys? Tell me. <laughs> yeah, I think that works together very well. Then have this one and this one. I knew that was gonna go there. Thank you so much, Animal Crossing. So... Let's tuck this bad boy in there. Ooh, yeah. See, I like that. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. I like that. Now, I'm thinking... What am I thinking? I'm thinking if I later then expand the cliff, we can have another tree here. And we can have maybe a bush. Mm, do we want that? Tell me. Maybe we can have a bush here. Do I have a bush? Nope. Let me grab a bush and a tree. <gasps> Look what I found! I do have more tea leaf, tree tea leaf trees, yeah. I wish we had tea leaf trees. Imagine we had trees with these kind of leaves. That would be so cute. So, now the question is, should we just fill up this entire thing? Or should we do a cliff tree? Because, would we use it? Because we can't fit a tree there, so we might as well just... You know, we might as well. Okay, tree here. But I think we will need to layer another, like, oh, another larger cedar here later. And maybe have one more tree here where the rock is. Just to kind of nestle it in some more. And have the backdrop of it be very full. And so that it looks like it's lying in the shadow. Should we have a bush here or here? I'm thinking here. So let's get started on the items, actually. <laughs> Because I wanted to do that a while ago and I haven't. So maybe put the wild log. No, not the wild log. I want to have the um, log bench here so that we can maybe layer some items. Yeah, will you go there? <gasps> Thank you. And then pull it out once just to make it visible. So I'm thinking definitely a little stool. And should we layer the zen cushion stack here? It's kind of hard to get through. 
So maybe against the tree. Mm. Now, you know, I wish my voiceovers would be as interesting as some of those YouTubers who can like talk about their villages and stuff because I can't, I don't talk to them that much. I am trying to get back into talking to them a lot more because I feel very bad for just having them because I need to have them. You know, and I do love all of my villagers, but I just never have the time to talk to them. And I just always get straight into designing and I feel very bad for that. So maybe have the simple kettle here, turn it around and then something on this sand cushion stack. Maybe this, this one. No, no, can we? Would you mind? Thank you. But I kind of want to turn this so that the red isn't as apparent. What does it look like if we turn it that way? Hmm. I think that works. What customizations are there for the mum's tea cozy actually? And I think I want to customize this too. Okay, let's see. Nope. Yeah, thank you. What are we thinking? I'm thinking... Hmm. Maybe exchange this one for the Zen Cushion stack just so that we can balance the color. Ooh, I think I like that. Actually, let me grab some more flowers and bushes right now. And let me grab that tree. Thank you. Love the cosmos. You've got to love the cosmos, even if you're not into astrology. Look at me being all funny, funny. Let's keep decorating this picnic space and then we can do the river bed in the end because we will need many flowers for that and I don't have enough pocket space for that yet. So maybe we can have a custom design here so that we can layer a smaller item there. Or we should maybe even do this, do this and then have an item here. Which item though? This one? Nope. Can you? Will you? Thank you. Oh, I don't like that. We can put that here. Where are you? Where are you? Thank you. And no, don't sit. Oh, my finger is itching. Ugh, I hate that. Do you know that itch like kind of underneath your skin and all that kind of helps is biting your finger? Or am I just a psychopath? Please tell me you know that feeling. Okay, so what about having a beekeeper's hive here oh i like that and then let me place down the cedar that i wanted to put here oh yeah mm -hmm. we just need one more tree for the hole i dug back there but i'm not sure which one yet maybe we can even do a peach tree i'm not sure why i just felt like peaches seem very fairy like in a way does that make any sense at all? Yeah, probably not. Nah, I think maybe we can get a tulip later and put it right here. Or maybe we can do that now. Grab this one, put it right here. And then maybe weed right here. Not that one though. Because again, meticulous weed placement. You know it by now, I, I'm not gonna, comment on it in the future thank you bitch. okay so what tea related items do we have i was thinking putting one mug or coffee cup on that stool and then having the other one sit just somewhere randomly on the bucket maybe we can do the book okay now what to do right here maybe we can drop some mush rooms right here just to not block off the space but have something here yeah i like that okay 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 mm -hmm. now we do right here oh yeah mm -hmm. and then have another custom design maybe to kind of create a pathway leading back here and then have another plank nice this is kind of coming together very nicely i'm pleasantly surprised i didn't know that i could design stuff that quickly even though i am already at 41 minutes do we like that ukulele there ukulele ukulele there or should we put it next to that zen cushion i kind of like it on top there might put that back in a second but no i don't want to do that no can would you mind thank you bitch. where are you my guy okay actually let me turn that like this so that we can pop this that way should we now exchange this mug for this one to balance out the yellow i think we might do that oh yeah mm -hmm. i kind of what do i prefer you know what we're gonna leave it we're gonna leave it like that no are we i will need to customize the cutting board the cushion and 
and maybe some of the other items right now anyway so i will check for the mom's tea cozy and then i will come back to you guys real quick all right y'all i'm back so i actually ended up grabbing some more flowers bushes and this little pumpkin sprout just because i like to decorate with them and i think I found a very cute customization for the mom's tea cozy. I never used it. I just always ever use the yellow one. But look. It's a cat. It's a cat. Look at it. Look at him. He's so cute. He's so cute. Okay, okay, okay. I'm gonna stop. I'm sorry. So let's tackle this little boy. What can we put? So I customized the cutting board so that it could match the um, picnic blanket and the cushion. And what can we put right here? Do we have any other item that we can put on a table maybe? Do I not? Oh boy. Well, that's a problem. Mm. Or oh, actually, I think I'm just going to drop a peach there whenever I get them from my house. I want to include a bike somewhere so I'm thinking right here would be a cute spot so that you kind of put your bike down right there and then you went to have a picnic with your friend. Um, I don't even know what I was going to say. Oh would you mind girl what the frick are you doing? Can you please? Thank you. Jesus. Okay perfect. I like that there. Where are my blue Come on, guys. Thank you. Only me calling my custom designs, guys. Well, talking about friends, right? Oh, that's the mom. Ooh, that kind of works, though. But do we want the mom cushion? Mm, I think I actually do prefer the mush. You know what? I think we have a winner. Uh, okay, so another bush. Just because shrubs are everything we need on this island. Where can we throw our pumpkin? Ooh, I kind of like that. Yeah, put the sparklies back. Where are you guys? Again, calling my custom design guys. I have hiccups, so that's great too. Is there enough space to, to add flowers? Let me check. Can you? Oh, you can. Perfect. But I... Mm -mm. Okay, actually, let me just so... We won't repeat the pattern of the flowers because we had like two by two, you know, we had like two right here and then two here. So we had like these two rows of two. Oh, Jesus, that's way too many twos. It's too late for me to form those types of sentences, as you can obviously tell. What the cricket am I even saying? What the cricket, Nina? <laughs> Okay, so I planted the flowers and I dropped the peach. Now I'm going to plant the tree here and um, like, but I'm not sure which one. But I still need to figure out what I would want to have right here. I'm thinking the classic picture because I think that ties in the yellow again. This here looks kind of empty to me so i was thinking where are the socks see so cute turn it around oh that's so cute look at it but should we exchange the cushion the cushion for the maybe we can have one pair of shoes right down here on like a little puddle so it looks like someone went to the picnic and then took off their shoes and kind of took a little walk into the river but which shoes would we use no nope. well actually that was so cute that's kind of cute why do i like that what about what about what about a duck what about a duck yeah duck it is and have another peach dropped here i kind of prefer that you know it it's a bit lighter look at our baby maple hi girl how you doing? Oh, she's so sweet. And then we can drop another peach down here behind the bike just to tie that in again. Should we drop a cupcake somewhere? Because I think we do. But where? Here? Hmm. I think that's cute. Yeah. Okay. So let me just grab a tree and then we're done. 
Alrighty y'all, so let me show you what we have done today in just one and a half hours. It will be so much fun to edit this. Okay, so anyways, so we have this nice little pathway. I did exchange this peach that we initially placed here for this balloon because I, um, yeah, well, because balloon. Um, <laughs> And then we have this very colorful picnic and I know it's a lot more colorful than you might be used to from my channel but I think I really like this vibe because I have never used as much color as in the last two builds and the especially this build and I really love it it feels so whimsical and magical and I especially love this trio of items um and the moccasins on the like the blue moccasins on the yellow low mush stool are very very cute to me so um yeah and then we have this nice little table right here um with a lock bench in the back and then we have just this little um, cardboard box with the lantern and the wild lock bench just to kind of fill up the space. And I really love how this turned out. Alrighty y'all, so this actually wraps up the build for today. I'm going to leave you now. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please make sure to give this video a like and subscribe to my channel. I would love to have you here. And yeah, take care of yourself. Until next time and bye bye.